doesn't have any running water, no bathroom. Um, it's basically just a garage. The Hancock Volunteer Fire Department Station 1 has stood since 1957. This side's even more cramped over here. But after being awarded roughly $1.5 million in congressional funding, the town plans to build a new station. The station is definitely not big enough, uh, and the land area that it sits on is not expandable enough. The new facility will be built on this plot of land directly across the street from their current station and will be twice the size, an expansion that the fire chief says is greatly needed. Just don't have enough room. Uh, we have ve three vehicles, uh, one's outside, two are in a in a tent, um, so we just we need more room. According to a member of the town select board, this project has been in the works for nearly a decade. Citizens of Hancock are involved. Some people are, and and the input was great, and uh, and you know it's a good thing. It's local. The fire chief hopes this will also help attract new recruits. Hopefully, with a new station, we'll have more room to grow. Uh, we should be set for quite a few years down the road. Um, hopefully also the new station. Uh, some people might be more interested in joining up and helping out. So. They are hoping to break ground on the project this fall. In Hancock, Grace Blanchard for ABC7 and Fox 22 News.